You know, Olympia is becoming the culinary capital of the great Northwest. You know, in Seattle, we got a lot of foodies. If you go down to Portland, there's a lot of foodies there. Um, but we're starting off the morning at a coffee roastery. I've got Arturo here. Now, I wore the wrong lipstick obviously but a good cup of coffee is one that you don't need to put anything in and i have been drinking this straight out the cup uh, but now there's actually some fancy setup you got here for me how do we cup coffee arturo sure well what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take a, our spoon and one of these cups okay and what we're gonna do is take a sample out of it what like kind of so, coffee is this this is a uh, coffee from ethiopia from uh Harar. Um, it's going to be a bit more fruity uh, than anything else that we have on the table right now. And we just so try grab your spoon it? and just go like this. Wait, I'm supposed to slurp it like that? Mm-hmm. Arturo, really? My parents taught me not to slurp. Well, you are now. Oh, but that's good. I, I spilled a little bit. Oh, that's very good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so then you dip it in the water? To, right. To, okay. So you don't cross-contaminate. So Got you do it. that, you do that with every cup. Okay. So now we go to the coffee from Colombia, which is from Huila. It's one of the uh, best of auction uh, in Colombia. Ooh. The slurping is key, though. Mm-hmm. That's done because all those flavors are going to go to the back of the mouth and your throat so that you can actually taste natural flavors in the coffee. Arturo, I have a question. Every right. time I slurp, I feel like I'm going to choke. <laughs> How do you do that? You're such a pro. A practice. A lot of practice. How long have you been here for and how long uh, have you been hosting these tastings for? <laughs> wait, look, I didn't know you could company? spit it out. Wait, hold on. I do. We can spit it out too? Sure you can. Okay, you don't sorry. have to ingest it. Oh. That's crazy. Okay, so how uh, long So have you nine and a half years and I've been uh, doing this tours for about two years now. So it's been pretty fun and... Mm. Ooh, yeah, that's good. That's and, good. Uh, we invite anybody who is... Um, available uh, to come in and take them. Yeah, so you can fit about seven to ten people comfortably right. in this nice space that you have here. And uh, how long does a tasting like this take? Because we've tried three here pretty quickly, but how many do you do you taste? Because I had no idea that coffee was so sure. different, just mm -hmm. like, you know, again, our wines and our beers. Right. So it, it, this will actually take about an, about an hour to do this whole, com whole completely. Yeah. Uh, but it's, you know, the aspect of you learn from beginning to the end of the coffee, from the seed to the cup. Right, So basically right. it's what we want to be able to take out uh, from the whole class. Fun and things so, to do in Olympia, Arturo. Absolutely. Thank you so much. I'm going to slurp and build right and get back on over to you. All right. Uh. That's, I, do, I don't, it sounds like when, when he, Ellen, I, like I know nothing I know. about this. I know, than I am. <laughs> He's had a little bit of practice. When he does it, it sounds like a zipper, almost. <laughs> Like a, like a zipper. It does sound like a zipper. And he, he laughed and he just, <laughs> we were laughing about how long it was going to take us to dirty our white shirts. He said, you sound like a zipper. <laughs> we'll try it again. Okay, wait, hold on. I can do better. All right, let's see. No. Mm -mm. <laughs> Broken zipper. <laughs> it's, you know, just like anything, it's just reps. You know, you just got to get your reps in. Yeah. You'll, you'll get it.